ready? Yep. Okay. Welcome back. I'm Christy and you've just completed the motorcycle safety course. And I thought we would make a quick video just to give you guys maybe some guidance and some pointers on what to do next. So I completed my motorcycle safety course in October. And some of the things that I found super helpful was to immerse myself in learning. So um, that meant that I went onto YouTube because YouTube is the best place to be for learning stuff. And I watched a bunch of videos. Adam always sent videos too that he thought were useful. Um, so I learned a lot of great things from a lot of you guys out there uh, just by watching videos. Another thing, um, I went to a uh, motorcycle shop and just tried on a bunch of different gear. Because you want to make sure you have all your gear ready for when you do get a bike. So your pants, your jacket, some shoes, a helmet, gloves, all of that. And find out what's comfortable for you. More to come in a future video on motorcycle gear, by the way. And then another thing I would recommend is um, check your area and see if there's like any motorcycle uh, conventions or um, anywhere where you can uh, sit on a bunch of different bikes so you can kind of feel what you like. You can go to used dealerships, new dealerships, or uh, what's that word, motorcycle rallies, is that it? Yes, motorcycle rallies, um, just to see what you like. And you want to kind of consider, because everybody's different, um, personal preferences. So. <laughs> Uh, is that like your riding position, the style of bike you want, like do you want a cruiser, do you want a sports bike, um, do you want an adventure bike, dirt bike, um, kind of get a feel for what it is that you like. Um, and then you can kind of go from there. Also, of course, price is going to be another thing that you think of. Um, more to come on that though in another future video, so stay tuned. Um, and let's see, is there anything else I'm forgetting, Adam? I feel like there's one thing I'm forgetting. No, I think that's it. I think I got it all. All right, we'll see you next time. Just, we're I, back. We're back. Okay. I remember. I remember. I remember that one thing. Um, go to the DMV as soon as you're done with your miles motorcycle course. Go to the DMV. Go ahead and get your license and get that process started. Um, that's exactly what I did when I when I finished my course. Also, if there was anything that you did after you completed your course, please feel free to drop it in the comments below because we would love to hear from you guys on uh, some other ideas. Thanks.